Oh, hoy there, Legion. 6.0 brought with it a few new things, but I think the healing changes are the biggest overall. Every class is something removed, baked in, changed, passives reworked, and talents are all jumbled up. And unless they've been fixed before this video goes live, Disco Priests, I feel for you. I've been leveling up my monk here, as well as my pally who's been AFK since Illidan, and they both have had the same issues, so just a quick heads up to anyone wondering what the heck is going on. First up, Everyone is squishy now, so don't pull entire instances. Heck, good luck if you accidentally pull two elite packs. Secondly, heals aren't godly. We can spam them, but unless you are at the current level cap in good gear, don't complain when it takes a minute to top everyone off. The numbers just aren't there. Squishy tanks and less than powerful heals leads to quite a deadly intersection, so fellow puggers out there, be prepared for wipes. Dark Souls thought it was rough, but they only killed one person at a time. Here, it happens at a far more efficient pentakill. There's a PC Master Race joke in there, but I just know someone's gonna invoke Godwin's Law in the comments, so... To max level characters, you shouldn't feel the pinch too bad. Healing seems to be more about spamming and less about mana conservation, which oddly enough is entirely opposite of what Blizzard claims they were aiming for. Go figure. As for support characters leveling up, you would do yourself a massive favor if you equip some heirlooms. Even just the chest and shoulder pieces will do. Luckily, you can mail them across faction and cross server, which I found out after leveling up to 45, but at least they're helping now. Just mail them to the character name hyphen no space server name. Unless you have a freaky deaky elvish server name, then good luck to you in that case. I don't want to say heirlooms are required, but let's just say that wiggle room you have of life or death when healing is really small now, and heirlooms help a great deal. I've had fresh DKs and full blue sets, and those are some strong blues they have on, and they are still squishy. I doubt any pugger can match that quality of gear from instance running, so heirlooms are the only thing that consists keeps you strong. It is still healable, but if the tank and the healer don't have heirlooms, best of luck to you. This might get tweaked in the coming month, but honestly, I'm not holding my breath. As you level, more skills open up, you'll be better off, so try to power through it. It's a heck of a hike, but if you can make it to 80, the gear from the random item bags and instance quests should be enough to keep you going, and from there, it should be self-sustaining. If we're up to me, I'd have it balanced for every level, but the best we can do is tackle the hand we are dealt with the best way possible. Thank you for watching, Legion. I'm working on both a Monk and Pally healing slash leveling guide for any interested. Be sure to subscribe to be alerted when those come out, as well as any future WOD X pack goodness. If you enjoyed this video or put a smile on your face, we'd be honored if you liked, favorited, and shared this with your fellow guildmates. As always, if you have any questions or suggestions, feel free to leave a comment below. Catch you next time, Legion. Take care.